this will be a quick video on the new Volvo John Deere Caterpillar in case I have recently bought. Well, my favorite out of all of them is definitely the John Deere. Um, it's a really nice model. Um, it's the 220D by Earl. Sadly, with Earl's models, I don't know, probably most of you know that if you own an Earl excavator, um, that the, when it, when it spins, it gets tight if you go right, just because the way I think it's the screws they have, I think the screws are actually set to go with the direction of the thing, but whatever. And then, I guess the second most liked uh, right now is the MD is the M the six, uh, 316D. I really like it. It's my only wheel excavator. Although I only have three excavators, including this one, but still, this is definitely obviously my only favorite wheel excavator because it's the only one I have. Anyway, really nice though. Perfect. There's nothing wrong with it. I think everything's right. No, it's all perfect. When I first bought it, the bucket was messed up. When every time I went to crank it in, the, there's a piece here that snapped off. But I fixed that, so that's the best part about that. Um, this is a really cheap model. I'm not, I don't spend a lot of money on my models, sadly. I really should spend more money because you pay for what you get. But uh, the Volvo is very, very. It's okay, I don't like it. I mean, the tracks are annoying, they're very hard. The bucket's a weird color compared to my paint that. Then, actually, nothing. Then they, what annoys me, they put a driver in the cab. <laughs> so it just, it's so dumb now, I think, I think it ruins the model. That's that model. And then we get on to the case, our last model. The 221E case. Uh, Wheeler, sorry I stuttered there. It's really nice, I like it. But sadly, the bucket doesn't tip out all the way, but whatever. You just lower it a little more, it'll dump all the way, but otherwise, nothing much to it just besides the bucket. That's all it really does. It's the bottom of the model side. Um, some things are edged, uh, this is an edge through all the way, but it looks like it is, but it's not edged through at all, really. These aren't edged through. They're not, no. This is not edged through. Don't think it is, because it's not. Anyway, I forgot to tell you the, what I also, this thing has the, the, the M316 also has the little push, push plow in the front. And then they have the little jacks. And one on each side. Um. My favorite model, though, out of the whole video will obviously be my John Deere 200D. But, um, thanks for watching. I'll try to get more videos up at the back of the dial. I have to restart my dial, then none of you probably saw it. Um, I'm going to restart it, though. I'll try to keep it a secret. But I'll just let you know I'm restarting because I put in sand and all these vehicles do not go in the sand. I also have a Bobcat. I'll do a review on that. And I also have a John Deere backhoe, but I'll do a review on that later. Alright? Thanks. Talk to you later. Bye.